We just checked into our hotel here at Lowe's. Let's give you the grand tour. Pretty bathroom. So the bathroom is to your left right when you walk in and then across from the bathroom is a little vanity where I'll be doing my makeup and hair. Going in to the room here. <laughs> My husband's trying to avoid the camera, but I can see his reflection. And this is the room. Complete with a dog. Complete with Murphy. Lowe's is a pet friendly hotel. Oh, Murphy, you look like a model. Model Poochie. To celebrate our anniversary and Something else that I haven't announced yet that I will announce later. I got us a bottle of Cristal. Popping bottles. I'm gonna open this with you because this is a really schnazzy box. Excuse me, Murphy. Oh. <laughs> and then we got this bottle of 1942 Don Julio. Woot woot. So this was a gift to my husband. Um, how long ago? Two years ago? And we still haven't drank it yet. This deserves a really good box opening. Ladies and gents, I present to you Crystal. Do you want some Crystal? <laughs> Do you want some crystal? <laughs> Makeup is done. I used the Natasha Denona Lila palette. <laughs> There's my hubs. Looking fine. He did his makeup too. <laughs> but yes, I did a little purple. I don't know if you can really tell the lighting here. Ooh, look at that highlight. Ooh. I used that champagne pop. Mm -hmm. I attempted to curl my hair, but typically when my hair is really clean, I washed it this morning, it doesn't hold curl, but I'm gonna curl it again tomorrow and it it like whoosh, looks awesome. But yeah, gave my hair a little bit of body today. And um, actually, let me show you the inside of this palette. Hold on, I'm gonna show you, I'm gonna turn it down. This is the Natasha Denona Lila palette. Let me show you the colors I used. I used these two right here to create this eye look. I've actually used almost all of the colors in here. Um, it's a new palette, so for me. Question, am I supposed to take this off? I'm not a big makeup person, as you know, so I don't know if that's supposed to come off. Tell me down in the comments. If you've never had Crystal before, it is really worth every penny. It is so smooth. We're having a Latin party in here. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. For the record, I've never had Crystal before, so don't think this is a regular thing. This was my gift to my husband for some exciting news. Gift and to myself. It was a gift to myself <laughs> for our anniversary, but also to my husband for some exciting news that I haven't told you yet. Whoa. Burgundy. I'm totally feel on the champagne already. Murphy, are you having a Latin party? Forever 21? No? Where are they from? She doesn't remember where they're from, but get from the hubbies. And then I'm gonna use this. I forgot what this is called. A 
purse. It's a I'm red. We literally almost missed our restaurant, Mako. There's an omakase style Japanese sushi extravaganza. Very unassuming door. Sorry, I had to pause there because I didn't want to record those people. And we're going in. So we are sitting here at the chef's bar. So omakase, which is the type of um, Japanese experience we're gonna have, means I'll leave it up to you. We trust the chef to just kind of guide us during this experience. And I'm super excited. Um, this restaurant was just rated in a, you know, what was it rated in? Michelin. No, not just Michelin. It is Michelin rated, by the way, but it was rated in that article you sent me. I don't know. But I'll post the article down below so you can take a look at what Marco is all about. Good morning, everyone. Today is Sunday. It's about 10.30 in the morning. I am ready to go to church. Um, I am going to be the godparent of uh, my cousin's child, Miles, um, and his baptism is December 21st. So in, I don't know if you're familiar with the Catholic religion, but if you are chosen as a godparent, you do have to take a, um, a short class and receive a certificate to um, be able to be the godparent um, at the baptism. So that's what I'm doing this morning. Last night, Matt and I had the best time. Uh, we got back and went to bed at 4 a.m. I think that's safe to say that we did it right and had a blast. Uh, dinner was fantastic. I think hands down that is the best meal I've ever had in my life. The pairings were spot on, and I'm talking about wine pairings, and in this case, it was more sake. So sake pairings were amazing. The fish was like buttery smooth. It was like, hands down, one of the best food experiences I've ever had. And then Matt and I bopped around town, went dancing, just had a really good time. So I'm gonna finish getting ready, put my stuff together, and then catch up with you later. All right, I am going to pack up my purse. The purse I've been using for the past couple of days is my Speedy 30. Um, it's bandolier. And, oh, let me show you this, by the way. So unfortunately, I had a small bag, so I had to fold this up. But when we ate at the restaurant afterwards, they gave us a copy of the menu from Mako. Like, not that you're gonna be able to read that, but I always find it really cool when they give you the menu afterwards. All right, let's see, focus, Christina, focus. Oh, by the way, so I got this little Joe Malone um, sampler from Sephora. It comes in like a two pack. I can't remember what the other scent is, but this is the wood sage and sea salt. I'm obsessed and I actually put it on my Christmas wish list, the actual big, big bottle. So we'll see if that's under the tree this year. Oh, and if you haven't seen my wallet yet, it's a little baby traveler's notebook. It's a nano size. And what I really like about it is like, I typically have a few inserts in here, but like last night I had small bags, so I just kept it really thin. I just used the two sides like so. I typically have it filled with like these inserts in here. I'll show you really quick. Here you go. 
perhaps a little bit thicker with the Melon Journals insert and um, a couple clear wallet inserts as well. And I am packed and ready to go. I need to find coffee before I head over because the girl's a little tired. Just carrying a large piece of art down the streets of Chicago. Yep, we're taking him to dinner. Yeah. Yeah, we can get you seated. Cool. Do you want us to check this for you? Sure. We wanted it to sit with us at dinner. Yes. How romantical. Thank you very much. Nice bar, too. Look at how pretty this drink is. This is the Champagne Smash. Let's give it a try. Oh my god. good. So fresh. The mint is really good. Yeah, put some butter on this bread. We're at the Looking Glass Theater, about to watch The Steadfast Tin Soldier. It's an original done by the ensemble here at the Looking Glass Theater. If you're not familiar with this theater, I wasn't either. Uh, you should definitely look it up. I'll link the link to this theater down below. Um, but I believe it's owned by Ross from Friends. What's his name? Schwimmer? What's his first name? David, David Schwimmer? Anyway, Ross from Friends owns this theater. It's a very, very cute theater. Look at how beautiful Michigan Avenue is at Christmas time. So pretty. Here we are at the Starbucks Reserve Roastery. It just opened last month. We were walking past it, so we decided to kind of give it a look-see. Look at all these delicious pastries. Coffee. We can go a cafe. Yeah, yeah, yeah. She's joining the dance too. <laughs> yeah, girl. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Yes, 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 yes. Yum, 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 yum.
Okay, we just got back from our adventures this afternoon. I don't know if you could tell earlier, but we went to the Merchandise Mart, which is like a showroom in Chicago, and they were having a one of a kind. How would you describe one of a kind? It was a, it was a fair. He's not paying attention to me. Craft artisan. An artisan, artisan craft fair, um, which was really awesome. My hubby got me these earrings. So pretty. And then I got, he also got me this bracelet. Super cute. And then we bought the giant painting that you saw us walking <laughs> with um, before we went to dinner. We also got a free little uh, canvas painting from the same artist. Fun fact about this artist, he did a couple of uh, custom pieces for Chip and Joanna Gaines. So it was really awesome to meet him. Really cool guy. I'll link him down below. I can't remember his name at the moment, but he's awesome. Then you saw us have dinner and the play that we saw was so good. It was a silent play. There was no, no talking in it at all. Um, and it was just a four piece orchestra. It, but it was so, it was like watching just a live piece of art. It was, it was really beautiful. I touched up my makeup a little bit. We are going to be meeting a few friends out. Just probably a little bit of bar hopping, walking around the city. One of my favorite things to do is just walk around the city at night. Delicious room service. Look at that French toast. Good morning, everyone. We are getting ready to check out of the hotel. We have to make a few stops since we're already downtown. Sephora and Royce Chocolate. I'm not sure if you're familiar with Royce, but it's um, a very luxe chocolate shop. I'm gonna grab some gifts from there and then head home to see the baby. Christmas cheer. So pretty. So we are at the shops at Northbridge, which is like a little shopping mall here um, on off of Michigan Avenue. Nordstrom's right behind me. Right now we're walking to Roy's Chocolate. I'll have to show you the inside of this shop. I was a good girl at Sephora. My reason for needing to go there was that I wanted a little ham during the Sephora Rouge sale. So I wanted to um, return a whole bunch of the drunk elephant face products that I bought. So I returned that and I was very good. I only um, restocked on my favorite mascara while I was there. So I got a big refund. Murphy's getting chocolate. chocolate these are one of my absolute favorite chocolate wafers it's little tiramisu um, chocolate wafer they are to die for gonna grab some to give to my mommy as a little thank you gift for watching Kai this weekend I'm gonna grab a box of these baton coconut cookies as well for my mama Beautiful, festive bags. Where I'm currently at, if I just buy a $100 bike on Craigslist and put an iPad in front of it, it's a Peloton. Why am I wrong? Um, because <laughs> We've been talking about getting a Peloton, so this is a good opportunity to kind of just try it out. The screen is so unbelievably clear. Scenic rides that you can choose from. Yeah, we don't carry the shoes here. We can. We just got home and I had a happy mail package waiting for me. I'm whispering because um, Kai's napping right now. That's why you can hear the white noise. That's the monitor that's going off. But I wanted to show you what um, I received when I got home. So I ordered this <sighs> traveler's notebook before. They came out with that um, discount code, so that was kind of a bummer, but it is okay because this is a beautiful piece of leather. I'm gonna try some better lighting, find some better lighting in this house so that you can get a really good 
uh, picture of this. Sorry about the glare, but it's a gloomy day and it's dark outside, so um, you might not get a proper color um, depiction. Oop, I hear the baby. But this is the Chic Sparrow Hemingway and the color Havana. And I asked for a lot of fat rolls and striations, and that's exactly what I got. So beautiful. Oh, you like Kai's artwork right here? Yep. Kai's Crayola artwork on the wall. Back with my little bestie. What are you eating, Kai? Cheese. He just woke up from his nap. Hair's a little crazy. <laughs> Did you have a good weekend, Kai? Oh, okay. <laughs> <laughs> Don't show your cheese. <laughs> Disco party fun! Dance, 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 dance. Yeah, 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 yeah. Toys everywhere. Toys everywhere. Yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> I just fell asleep and I just made some chamomile tea and I thought we would go ahead and start this advent calendar together. I know it's nine days late, but that means I get to enjoy two pieces of chocolate for the next nine days. So this is the Lint Teddy advent calendar. Super cute. And let's open up day. What I'm going to do is I'm going to do day nine and then also open day one. And I'll do that until I get caught up with all the days. Oh. All right. So today is the ninth. Let's open this guy up. Little. Oh no! Runaway chocolate. <laughs> um, I will check. It looked like a little um, chocolate ball. I can still hear it rolling away. <laughs> now let's find day one on here. Can you say day one? Oh, there it is. Okay, let's open this up. I didn't get a chance to open up Kai's. Oh, look. It looks like it's the same exact thing as on the 9th. I believe it's just like a little milk chocolate ball. So I get to enjoy two of these with my tea tonight. What I was trying to say is that I totally forgot to open up Kai's um, advent calendar today. So we'll start that tomorrow. All right, guys, thanks so much for joining us this weekend to celebrate our anniversary. I hope you guys enjoyed, and I'll be back to daily vlogging tomorrow. So, all right, guys, until tomorrow, see ya.